Hey guys, it's me. You know, I always start like this. Like we all have our own way of doing it and I guess that's how I start my lives. <laughs> I'm gonna show you this palette tonight, but I'm gonna stick to the blues. So like I just did, let me show you a precursor of what I just did on my other lives. Last time I showed you palette six and I did the rose colored and then I did the browns. I absolutely adore the browns in palette six. Like that was a really good look. So tonight I thought we would go with the blues in palette four and then we'll jump to the browns next time. I gotta have a plan, you guys. So these three colors, honest, grateful, and triumphant, okay? These are the three we're gonna do tonight, okay? So you guys are gonna help me figure out lips and all that jazz. I do not have anywhere I have to go right now, yay! is garbage blowing across our backyard awesome yay we're gonna have to get that cleaned up well it is windy 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 everywhere here so my kids and I were outside flying a kite I'm gonna post that in a little bit on my personal wall hey Margarita how are you so I was just telling everybody that we're gonna do palette four and we're gonna look at the blues tonight and then I'll come back from tomorrow maybe tomorrow and do the browns um, I have a couple more places to go tomorrow, but I'll work it in somewhere. Saturday's my really busy day because that's the day we have our Idaho Science Olympiad. And it I have to leave the house like between 7.45 and 8. And I won't get home until dinner time. So that is going to be like a majorly late day. So I might possibly not go live that day. Or I might do it at the end of the day if I am up to it. It's going to be crazy. But today, let's do the blues on palette four. I just washed my hair today. I know you guys really want to know that. But I haven't had a chance to curl it. Because, of course, everything goes in stages. So, like, I'll wash it, but I can't quite have time to curl it. So, here's where we're at. All right. I don't know why I felt like I needed to tell you guys that. But I'm going to tell you. All right, you guys. I'm going to use some Splurge Cream Shadow in Victoria's. Say hi when you hop on. Say, um, tell me, tell me what the weather's like where you're at. I think of random things to ask you guys. So it's really super windy here and it feels like the wind is so cold. It feels like winter is coming back. Like that's not good. I was so cold out there flying that kite with my kids, but it was great to know we were making memories. So I was glad to get it and I got videotape of it. I'm going to post it later. All right, you guys, if the lighting is not um, strong enough, I will turn my ring light on, but right now I'm taking natural light that I've got left. Um, it's already seven o'clock here, so we still have some natural light, but not tons. All right, you guys, I'm gonna start with this color, actually. It's called Honest, okay? I'm gonna stick with the blues in palette four. You guys, these are still on sale. They're 20% off. Addiction Shadow Palette of your choice, an Epic Mascara of your choice, and then a splash liquid lipstick of your choice, you guys. So there we go. I don't know what color I'm going to use on my lips tonight either. So I think we're just going to play it by ear and let's see how it goes, you guys. But first, I need to clean my brushes because I always forget this, you guys. I always forget this. Okay, so I'm going to get my brush cleaner out. This is how you do it. It's one way to do it. And I'm going to wipe them on my handy dandy hand towel that is under all my stuff. I keep a hand towel here ready to go underneath my, can I make sure what I'm grabbing here, um, underneath my um, brushes and all my stuff here, my blushes, my liquid lipstick, all these things. All right, let's go ahead and get started with this color right here. It's called Honest. And it's such a nice color. Oh, you guys, I haven't put any eye primer on either. I'm going to do that really quick. Ah. Sometimes you're organized and sometimes you're not. I think I'm going to err on the side where I'm not, but that's okay. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and put a little eye primer on. By the way, palette number six, the one that just came out, the rose and brown one, is infused with eye primer, you guys. That is such an amazing thing. Okay, I've already got it on there, but I'm gonna, whoops. 
I grabbed the wrong brush. Oh my gosh. All right, let's go ahead and get started. This is that light blue color and it is called Honest. Tell me if I need more light and I will turn my ring light on, okay? I'm trying to stick with like natural lighting, but we're right in the middle of that it might fade away kind of look. Sorry, I'm gonna hold on to this. Hey, Taya, how are you? Hey, Mercedes, hey, Jenny. All right, so we are doing palette number four and we're just doing the blues tonight. I'm gonna try to stick with the blues. So we just did Honest. Now I'm gonna go ahead and I actually am going to grab <laughs> this brush. This is the one I just stuck in Honest again, like the other color. And we're gonna grab Grateful. I think this is Grateful. I actually can't really read it because some of the letters are coming off, so that's awesome. I think it says Grateful. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try Grateful and I hope that that's what it's called. We actually have like a brown color called Grateful too in Splurge Cream Shadow. So that's a little confusing. I'm surprised they named it the same, but that's okay. All right. What is the weather like where you guys are at, by the way? That's my question of the night. While I put Grateful from palette number four on, it's on sale right now. It's on my website, you guys. BrittleLashes.com will take you straight to the April Kudos, you guys. You need to go save yourself 20% on these products. Like, you're going to use them anyway, right? So... You might as well get them on sale. <laughs> you like my shirt. Thank you, Jonah. Yes, I love it too. And special bonus, it's a hoodie. I can't live without my hoodies. So yes, I know this, I love this shirt. It's really thin, which is great for like um, layering for spring too. Spring and fall, I think. It's gonna be handy. concentrating concentrate oh my gosh I feel like doing some weird voices tonight Jenny it's rubbing off on me you guys are always doing your British accents concentrate I feel like more more like doing an accent I know I can't do because I'm never around the East Coasters but that's the kind of voice I, I feel like saying right now All right, um, I'm gonna grab a little more of that color and I'm gonna bring it down underneath. Look at that blue, so pretty. I love layering like a light and a darker color um, under my eyes as well. So I'm gonna take that kind of medium blue and then I'm gonna end up putting Triumphant on. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be pretty. You guys, I actually usually combine colors like the browns and the blues but I really like what I've been doing lately, which is actually um, just sticking with like one color family this month. I've just been sticking with like one color family for the most part. And I actually am having a really good time with it. Okay, this is triumphant. It's gonna look funky wonky when I put it on at first because it's, you know, Super dark and I'm putting it on in, you know, a V. So it looks weird right now, but once I blend it out, it's gonna look good. I have high hopes of it anyway. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna bring that, while I still have some on my brush, I'm gonna go ahead and bring that underneath my eye. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and bring that blender brush up there, upstairs, up there again. Upstairs, above my eye. And just blend that in really quick. I'm just doing the blues in Addiction Palette number four. On sale right now, brittalashes.com. I'll say it again. Comment, like, share my video, you guys. I need your help. Oh, and if you wanna talk about the new kits, like they are amazing. I need to learn more about them, but they are, they are like ready to go. As soon as you get your kits, that just started on April 1st, like you are gonna be able to sell straight out of your kit, you guys, it's crazy. And you'll get like, you'll make back like tons of the money back. Um, isn't that professional? Like that's so professional. I'm gonna go ahead and use this angled brush and I'm actually gonna get just a tiny bit more of that dark blue triumphant on, okay? <laughs> My uh, professional words here. 
I'm just kind of bringing it over into the middle just a tiny bit more because, you know, we need more of this. We need more of this color. Triumphant, the dark blue, the dark blue one. All right, I am going to look at your comments. Oh, you live in Vester. Oh my gosh, it was in the 80s. Why is I? Yes, Alabama. So, are you hot too? Marnie, why am I so brave? Hey, I am fierce. I am strong. I am enough. I am hopeful. I am beautiful. So I am brave too. There you go. <laughs> Sorry, that worked. That worked with what you said. So I love you. Oh my gosh. Marnie and I actually, Marnie, we went to high school together, didn't we? Oh my gosh. It's been so many years. We won't say how many years. Okay. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm cracking myself up again. Okay, so the question is, should I use this color as an eyeliner or should I, should I, um, should I use a black? What do you guys think? I'll give you a second. I'm gonna go ahead and put some um, vanilla bonbon on my lips really quick while I'm waiting for an answer. Eyeliner, should I use black? dip and draw like I usually do? Or should I do like, should I know? Seriously, like I'm trying to keep track. Okay, Jenny, let's do black. Cause I kind of think that if I use that one over the top of it, it's gonna already like, it's gonna be like, it might be a little bit, it might not show up very well. That's what I'm trying to say. All right, can you guys even see this? My light is fading a little bit right now, but I'm waiting for my hubby to finish dinner. My hubby makes dinner for us, you guys. It's so great. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. You guys, I'm sorry. I forgot to go back with this one and do my lids. Ah, I am all over the place tonight. Okay, guys. I started with this one and I'm gonna go with it again. Oh my gosh. So, uh. All right, let's take a little rose water. I am like out of it tonight, you guys. I think it's just been a long day. All right, I'm taking that first one that I just used. I just got it wet and it's a really light, it's probably just a satin. It's not super shimmery or anything like that. And I got it wet. It's called Honest. I'm gonna grab my sponge brush because I want it to be a little bit more than it is right now. There we go. That's more what I'm looking for. Can you guys see that? Yeah, that's better. Okay. The sponge brush is really good at packing it on a little bit more. All right. So we're kind of going with a little bit more subtle lid now tonight. Okay, now let's go on to the dip, dip and draw. I did not just say that. <laughs> All right, dip and draw. All right, you guys, first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up just a little. I'm using the tiny end of our, this is like the concealer end. We have a powder puff brush, you guys, that has a concealer end on it too. And I'm just taking um, my Scarlet pressed powder and I'm kind of erasing a little bit. Okay, now we're ready. It's probably all dried out now, so let me start over. Oh my gosh. Ah. All right, let's do it. Let's do this. Let's do this thing. And you know, I can't talk when I do this because it can sense your fear. And now my other contact is kind of fuzzing out on me so I can't see very well. I got new contacts um, a couple months ago and I am not liking them that much. Okay, I know I got a little bit right there. So let's go ahead and take my concealer brush, which is really not a concealer brush at all. It's actually a splurge grape shadow brush. And we're just gonna kind of clean that up. 
Anyway, my contacts are a different brand than I had before, and he told me, oh, you'll save more money on the rebate. Well, the rebate is like points, and then you have to go and decide what to spend the points on. And I finally did that, and that's all well and fine, but the contacts, like, I cannot get them out and take them back in. Like, not the same ones anyway. Like, I'm having the worst time. Like, I'm having to start over with new contacts every time I take them out, which is, it's going to get expensive because they're supposed to last me for a month. And, um, I don't think it's going to happen. Anyway, all that is to say is it feels like they've been fuzzing up more than my other brand also. So I'm probably going to go back to my more expensive brand that actually works for me better. Because saving money is one thing, but um, having it be like fuzzed up and then not be able to take them out of your eyes because you can't get them back in is like a big problem too. So looks like I went up a little bit. No. All right. All right. So we got that on. And it looks like I got a little bit, just a second. Gotta take the right color here. Oh, and I should probably uh, do the blow dryer real quick again. <laughs> Let me just freeze that into place. That looks so pretty though. All right, so I'm definitely feeling like we need, oops, sorry. I changed the lighting <laughs> when I put my arms up. I'm definitely feeling like we need, um, some fun lips too tonight because that is a really pretty fade out. Look at that blue, you guys. I, I love it. You guys, I don't have any, I don't have any mascara on at all. So let's get started on that. All right. So the question of the night is what is the weather doing where you're at? Are you getting like rain showers? Oh, great. Dinner. Dinner. And it's my favorite. It's spaghetti. You guys, I am such a pasta hound. Like, I cannot get enough pasta. When we have pasta, like, I'm, like, I finish dinner, I get the right portion, and then I walk over to the stove, and I, like, keep eating it. It's so, so bad. So bad. It's so bad. But I just cannot even stop myself. It is definitely my weakness. What is your weakness food? Is it chocolate? Is it pasta? Like, what is it? For me, it's definitely spaghetti or pasta. It's usually like specifically spaghetti like that for some reason just gets me. Oh, it drives me crazy. I don't even have to have anything on my pasta either. Like I can have it totally plain and I'm like so happy. It's, I'm probably like missing some mineral in my element in my body or something and that's why. But who knows? Okay, so we've got blue on. Like, I love that. That is a pretty eye, you guys. I don't do this nearly often enough. I am really liking staying with the color family that I'm doing, too. Like, I'm just doing the blues, and then next time we're going to do the browns. Like, I am, like, excited about this all of a sudden. Um, it um, It's taken me by surprise. Oh, you did? How funny. You had spaghetti too. Okay, guys, seriously though, what should we do with the lips? Should we do like, should we do like neutral lips? Should we do pink lips? Should we do red lips? Should we do something else? I mean, I even have this crazy color, which really just looks like pink on, honestly. It's like a metallic pink. But I don't know if that's the one I'm, I don't know. Oh, you know what I could do? Okay, I know they don't even sell it anymore, I don't think. This is so full. But actually, a peach would look kind of pretty. So let me see if I can find, like, I want to do, like, ombre lips. So, like, this would be the dark color. This used to be one of my favorite colors, by the way. So let me see if I can find um, a color that would match. Because I need a light color and a dark color. No, not spray. Definitely not spray. All right, I'm gonna just kind of hold this over the top. Hmm. I could do sublime. It's not a, it's not exactly, it's not really a peach. I don't think we really have another peach. 
Crab and Sublime. Stately? No, that's more of a rose color. Like, I cannot see these across the way. Oh, that's kind of pretty. It's almost like this one's almost kind of a more of a pink, but it's almost like a warm pink. All right, you guys, I got to try to see what this is. Sorry, I've got to get this out. Soft hearted. I knew it was. I knew it was soft hearted. Okay, I got to be quick because they're eating dinner now without me. So we're going to do soft hearted and we're going to do soulful. I cannot remember names for it to save my life. Okay, so I'm going to apply this first. Yes, I think these will work really well together because Soft Hearted actually does have kind of a peachy color to it. And I'm doing it the reverse way that I normally do. I gotta hurry anyway, because the light is just about to leave the fence, which is reflecting on my face right now. Okay, so full. You guys, with this one, I'm gonna go in with the brush. The smush. That is the lip transfer right there. So pretty. I love it. I love soulful. Soulful and soft hearted do go together well. You guys like that? So peach and blue. That's what I've got going. We could totally have done pink. We could have done red. We could have done a lot of things. I am going to grab this one, however, which is tender it's so popular in this and just lightly go over the lips because it's got a little bit of shimmer and we like the shimmer and i don't need a blue shimmer on my lips right okay um last things i'm just gonna go ahead and redo my lashes because i only did one round of epic okay get your base did you see how i only did one layer of epic first and I kind of let it dry. That's what you want to do you guys when you apply your epic. And we have premier subscriptions now so if you want to just try it, try the epic mascara. It is free shipping you guys. And on top of that you also get dum, bum, 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 a free sample with every epic subscription you guys. Every time an epic subscription is delivered to you, you get a free sample of something and it's always a mystery until it comes. So for sure, that's cool. Free shipping and you choose how often you get it. You choose what you get. You can get waterproof, black, or you can get brown. Crazy. Okay, let me blow dry this. You need palette number four in your life. Let's get this on your eyes, you guys. All right. Yes. So I kind of did neutral, right? All right. So I hope you guys like this. I love it. Like I even surprised myself how much I loved it. So let me know if you need some more info about this or just go to brittalashes.com and you will see the choices for yourself. Okay. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for supporting me and share, like, comment, okay? That's what I ask every time. You are beautiful, whether you have makeup on or not, and so am I. Have a beautiful weekend, and I will try my best to go live tomorrow and Saturday. I'm gonna be really busy the next two days. I love you guys so much. Okay, talk to you guys later. Bye.